Hi guys, welcome to my channel. I am Shakira Love and on this channel I do reaction videos. So if that's something you guys are interested in, go ahead and subscribe to the channel and also leave a like on the video guys. Let me know what you think about the video in the comments and yeah. So today we're going to get frosty, okay? I got a video from Frostmere TV and it says scary videos that will wake you up tonight. Okay, so shout out to Frost Smear TV and um yeah, let's get into this video. Not so empty, okay. This video was forwarded by Phoenix Eleven and found on the dark dimension. The user told me that yet again we are looking at an older VHS recording. It was taped by a real estate agent. The former owner, an elderly man, had passed away recently in this house. The family had put their house up for sale after this. The agent stated that the camcorder had never malfunctioned in the past, but this night there seemed to be a lot of glitches that appeared on the tape. There were also noises that sounded like screams in the background. really weird but the scariest thing was what happened after the camera filmed down from the first floor towards the living room okay i don't see no oh we clearly can see somebody sitting there but nobody else was with the agent so how was this possible and then, in this malfunction, it looks like a creepy face appears on the video material. Was it the former owner, perhaps? Looks like an old man sitting down. That's what it looks like to me. Like somebody just sitting down relaxing, you know? Creepy peeper. Paul Leo has uploaded the following unsettling image to the paranormal Reddit section. The user states, can you identify what this face-like image could be? Photo taken by a family friend. It was taken in the summer for everyone asking. Taken by our older neighbor. It was captured next to a cemetery. It is pretty obvious that a creepy face is lurking over the fence. Listen, I hate a peeping Tom. No Much as a dead people. one. But how is that possible? Nah was no prop and nobody was on the other side of the fence a terrifying thought knowing that something might have been right in front of you like that would you say yeah that would freak me out now we will follow japanese paranormal investigator mtb who tonight was visiting a supposedly haunted high school which has been abandoned for a long time. He states that he had visited this place before and that he could capture a ton of really weird noises that in his opinion were inexplicable. Tonight he brought a colleague and they were hoping to maybe capture some of this evidence on video. Let's take a look. これ、やすちゃんから借りてきたもので、チェキ。ちょっと気になるところ何枚か撮って、後で見ようと思います。さっきのあの顔がひょこっと出た。What? すごいですね。その時点でちょっと借りたいなとは思いますけど、何枚かじゃあ中で撮ります。ここら辺でも音が結構してたんで。<笑> 
ちのうちあたりを取っておこうかなと It got pretty interesting. Next to Lord Banks from the second floor, the washroom area also seemed suspicious to him, so he gave this one a quick look at first. But after not finding anything on his camera, MTB then says that it is time to give the second floor a last look. And who knows, maybe he would find something there. You see that head? It appears that a head is peeking through, straight through the wall. Some people say it could just be some form of pareidolia, but I certainly think that something is there. Is it a creepy head? What do you think? No, it looks like a head. User Asher Cream states, these images were captured by our old house years ago. Back then, when I was a kid, I can actually sense some paranormal kinds of stuff, and I think these old images are good evidence about a lady I saw in this house ever so often. Nobody smiles like that. Apparently, this was not a family member. No, was it a person? Like, she's just laying there, like, hi! What do you think about that? Was it a spirit? Well, merely another family member that stuck onto the bench in the back. Hey, she's a part of the family. She's just, you know, smiling for the camera and all of that. Like, hmm, that's creepy. Mysterious. Another haunted home. The following is an unsettling case that was documented by user Chloe Hart. She recently moved into a new home with her family. And as we have learned, sometimes these houses inherit some ghosts from the past. Chloe was initially doing a geography for her profile and then captured something strange on her staircase. And she swears that it was none of her pets. However, before we take a look at that, Chloe states that weird things are happening in this house all the time, like here for example. <sighs> Strange, right? Let's take a look at her clip now. Something just pulled the baby foot. I couldn't say if it looked like an animal though. Some people think it did. What do you think happened here? Was it just a family member that was home and Chloe didn't know? Or a paranormal event? Girl, I think it's time to move. Call a priest or something, but no. Nah. Next, we want to take a look at a creepy quick capture that was shared by a concerned user on Reddit. He states that he also was living in a haunted apartment and that on one week something really scary was captured. The user states, 
here we see a girl that doesn't belong. Can you see it? A comment reads, oh my, I see her. She's standing as if she's looking at something on the wall, like from the early 1900s. The uploader says, yes, that's her. That room is empty. Well, it's supposed to be anyway. This was taken in a burst of pictures, and all of the ones before had nothing in it. The real girl asked her dad to take pictures of her and her friend. This is what he got when he did it. Could he capture a girl from the other side? What's your thoughts? Yeah, probably. She probably lived there before, you know, a long time ago. You know, her spirit is still this there. Was, you know, a few weeks ago, I started looking at the case of Remy Code, who shares her encounters with a terrifying shadow apparition on her Reddit profile. She has placed several cameras in her apartment to capture all of this activity, which unfolds mostly while she is asleep. Tonight, she believes to have captured a shadow moving out of a chair. Take a look. Remy states that it's not a reflection from the other side of the room, and since she was alone and sleeping, was it the same apparition that she had captured weeks prior? Let me know. Like, listen, you're not just gonna be walking past my room door like that, okay? No. While I'm sleeping, no. It's creepy. The following video was shared by Ashley Rain on her TikTok profile. Usually, the young mother uploads videos that revolve about her family life. She shares funny skits and memories that she's recording together with her kids. Today's video is shaped out to be a little bit different though. Ashley noticed something really odd on one of the recordings on her home security system. It was in the middle of the night and everybody was asleep. Everybody but the cat. Like, what the fuck? But there's something clearly picking out of the room to the left. People say that it looks like a creepy head that is completely sideways. What the hell that is? It then shoots a bit. I look like eyes. Up there before like eyes. The That's how it looks to me. The family was really scared. That cat just sitting there though. Maybe he didn't notice it. That night. How terrifying when you say. I don't know what to think of that. It looks like eyes to me, like, hey. <laughs> the following video was sent by Chris Bogey. He's contacting the spirit world regularly. Listen, stay away from my car, okay? YouTube channel, Ghost Riders Paranormal. The following night, he was contacting the spirit of Shannon Watts. Check the card in the top right corner if you want to find out more about paranormal sightings in their old home. Chris believes to have had a really deep conversation with her spirit. And Why did it look like he crying or something? Bright appeared outside of his car. <laughs> Do you want to talk to <laughs> 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 
Yo! Chris states, it looks like a thermal image, it's crazy. You can see her face, her hair, and the back of her head. You can make out curls. If you really look closely, curls. The of her head. It's really an interesting capture. What do you guys think? Could he actually record a spirit here? Or is it just caramel lights from the outside? I mean, you go looking for stuff. What do you think? Jordan Moore has uploaded the following video, which he describes as really terrifying and concerning. He received the footage from a fellow paranormal investigator. The man who had recorded it stated that in this particular house, strange occurrences were almost a daily phenomenon. Unexplainable shadows, cold drafts, and noises in the midst of night kept the occupants of the following house pretty busy. One it's time to call the priest. Or a pastor. No, no, you need to get out of here. No, you're not just going to come and look like that, okay? A shadow man is leaning into the frame with glowing bright eyes and a large hat. People suspect that this could have been the infamous hat man that has been captured by countless people around the world and that is being seen in many people's nightmares. Could this be the reason for all the paranormal activity in this home? It certainly is an extremely frightening encounter for anybody. I yeah. Say. Listen, guys, that's, that's creepy. That's seriously creepy. Or a real otherworldly presence. I don't even want to look at him. The Explorer. The next clip was forwarded by Fireplant, and the story goes that it was recorded by an urban explorer one night who was investigating an old abandoned clinic. And the legends were saying that ghosts from the past can be seen in there once in a while. The man said that he only noticed after returning home that there seemed something off in one part of his recording. Like, hold up. We're not going to act like we just did not see that. That looks like a girl dancing. Okay. Could this be somebody else? The man says that he certainly was alone that night. So, if it wasn't a homeless person, are we witnessing a paranormal encounter here? What's your opinion? Hard to say. Oh. For this next story, we want to warn you. The facts are... Listen, guys. That was creepy. That last one was creepy. Mm -mm. Like that looked like a girl Like she's just there dancing I don't know But why do they go to these places though All by themselves Like I don't know They're brave as hell Cause not me That's not even a thought In my head You know what I'm saying But thanks for tuning in today guys Thanks for watching this video Um, I'll catch you guys in the next one Okay If you like this video Go ahead and comment down below Leave a like on the video And subscribe guys 
All right, have a blessed one.